happy Monday, good people. It's coming to you from the gym once again. But today I'm doing an evening class because tomorrow we're taking the toddler to another Christmas lighting show at the Botanica Botanic, I don't even know how to say that word. You know what I mean? Something garden. Yeah. So we're going to do that tomorrow. So I asked my auntie to keep her tonight so that I can get my gym workout in because I'm going to miss my session tomorrow night. But I am going to work out tomorrow, but not at the gym since we're going to be gone during the time of my class. So I'm doing it today. Anyways, today has been a good, productive day. Water, not so much. Oh, look at this. I'm down at, I don't know if y'all have ever had one of these bottles, but I totally recommend it because it has like the time on there. So if you fill it up one time, you go down this side, and then when you fill it back up, you do this side, which is like 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. Anyway, so that's like 72 ounces per day you're getting just with that one bottle. It helps me stay on track, probably not today. <laughs> but it usually helps me stay on track and I'm able to track what I drink as well and then like I said you only have to fill it up twice a day but if you're working out you should be drinking more but baby steps baby steps and that's my baby step so I'm doing two bottles a day that's all I can do and then from there my water should be good for the day how are you guys doing hopefully you all are doing well um to all my new subscribers thanks for joining Keisha I appreciate you I appreciate the comments the likes the subscriptions all the above like y'all mean the world to me Mwah. thank you I appreciate you once again so uh, if you're new to the channel I am following WW plan of the personal points uh, if you have not heard of the plan or my review on it please go see my prior videos i kind of touch bases in regards to what i'm doing my points value so on and so forth today has actually been a good day in, in regards to my eating um i have 13 points left for tonight because i ate the because i get 31 a day so that means i ate 17 points just this morning so that means i got 13 left for the day i'll probably not eat all those points just because when i get home it's gonna be dinner time i already know what i'm gonna have i'm gonna have four points which is gonna be for my turkey bacon eggs are free and then toast is gonna be two so that's only six points i might have like a little dessert i don't know which dessert i'll have but that's pretty much the coverage um with my weight watcher points for the day but so far i have 13 points left which i'm on track weigh-in is gonna be wednesday so I'm going to work out today, work out tomorrow, waiting on Wednesday. So we'll see how this week actually, last week actually go, went for me for my weigh-in on Wednesday. Uh, I don't think I've got anything else to touch bases. Let me go ahead and get in this good old gym. It looks a little crowded because it's Monday. You know, everybody be trying to get in on Mondays. And I'm just like, whoo, that's why I'm like coming at this time. Five o'clock is already rush hour. And on Monday, and then at the other part of the gym I really dislike is when um, the New Year's. That's another problem. Like, you just run into so many New Year, new goals, weight loss journeys for like two months. And then it just die off then. But other than that, January comes, it's all going to be bad up in here. But we just got to hang in there and just pray about it. Mm, mm, mm. Well, let me get in here because people are looking at me like I'm strange. We all trying to down our pre-workout. I already down mine. Ching, ching, ching. Yes, the baby bottle is back. But anyways, let me get off here, go work out, and I will touch bases with you all later because I have two minutes before class started. Did not see that. Bye-bye. So I'm not going to be at the gym today. It is Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, everyone. I know the lighting is about to get bad, but just roll with me. I am at home going to my home gym. <laughs> going to work out downstairs <laughs> because we're going to go see Christmas lights more Christmas lights tonight anyways let me show you give you a preview 
of my gym. So this, these are my mirrors, treadmill, pan over, my Peloton sign. Don't y'all like it? Isn't it cute? Yes. Have my bench here along with some weights. Got that um, body pump bar basically and some weights, some more weights are over there in the corner by the treadmill. And then we have my spin shoes, my regular shoes, my mat, my TV, where I project like different stuff, like my Peloton, uh, workout sometimes. Uh, anyways, that's pretty much the preview of my downstairs workout space. So this is the beauty, Mrs. Peloton. Oops, I'm gonna turn it on. I'm gonna do some Peloton today. And what I am going to do after it loads, actually while we're waiting on it to load, see, isn't she cute? So cute, so cute. Got my weights on the back, I have two pound weights, yes. Anyways, it's starting to load. So we have that, I already have my stack done. If y'all ever wanna know about the Peloton, more about it, I am willing to share, but today it's just basically going to be a quick workout. Come on, Peloton, we're going to Kinsha. 10 classes in my stack, view stack. So I've already stacked this earlier. So today I have multiple rides on here, but I'm just gonna go with the top because you always start with this top, you do your start button and boom, you start the workout. And then it just goes because your stack is basically saying, these are the classes I wanna do back to back to back. And Today, I'm going to do 15 minutes of R&B with Tune Day. I have done that before, but it's more of a warm-up ride. And then I'm going to have 30 minutes hitting heels with Robin. And then 30 minutes gluten legs with Chase. So I'm going to try to get that done in an hour and 15 minute workout before we leave, before the little one comes back. And I can get my workout together. Yes. And with the Peloton, let me show you all. So I have an Apple Watch. You can link it. Oh, and it says connect. So you push connect. It will connect to the workout over here. I'm not even gonna turn that up because it's gonna be copyright. Ain't nobody got time for that. So this right here is like my heart rate. It will reflect as soon as Apple registers my heart rate. You know how that it, that journey can be like a minute or two. Anyway, it's already popped up. So that's my heart rate. This is my zone. And these are my stride scores. Anyways, like I said, if y'all ever want to know a rundown on the Peloton and how I like it, please comment below and we shall give you a tour of my Peloton. But for now, I'm going to get my shoes on. I got my El Agua. Hey, water. I need more of that because I'm struggling today. Anyways, I got 15 seconds before it starts. So let me get to it.
Thursday and it is so cold outside. Burr, 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 burr. But anyways, today is Thursday. Good old Thursday. I took off yesterday, guys. I don't know. I was supposed to weigh in. I did not work yet. I did not work out. I was so tired because she came early. And I blow. Oh my gosh. I hate when she comes like and then when she came early, it threw me all off because you're heavy, heavy, and then you're just not motivated to do anything. So that was me all day yesterday. But today, kicking it back in gear. Oh, yeah. So today is Thursday night class, 530 with Darren, you know, the cutie with the booty. So I'm going to be going to his class, getting it in. I might do 10 minutes if I can get in here on time. Yeah, I can do 10 minutes because he's always late anyways. So 10 minutes of cardio before his class today and then probably 15 minutes more after class if I have the energy. If I have the energy. But we shall see. Because yesterday was a relaxed day. I should have all the energy built up. Hmm. Eating was good today. I have 14 more points left to eat. Saving that for dinner. I don't know how y'all do y'all's Weight Watchers, but with me, I like to eat majority of my points at night. So dinner time, basically. And then while I'm at work, you're preoccupied. You can pretty much get away with skimping your, your points. So I had 15 points from 6 a.m. this morning until 5.30 tonight. So that's actually really, really good. Um, I don't know what I'm having for dinner tonight. I do know I need to get gas. <laughs> Anybody else? I hate pumping gas. I hate pumping gas. Man, back in the day, we used to have people, you drive up to Athena. I'm from the South, so we used to drive up to Athena, and my grandmother used to be like, fill her up. Why can't we still do that? Like, those are the good old days, because I hate pumping gas, especially when it's cold, hot, sunny, cloudy. I don't care what day or what the weather looks like. I just hate pumping gas because you got to get out and then you got to put the card into the, th oh, it's just so much for my life. So I just don't like it, but that's just me. I hope y'all like pumping gas because I don't I always let it dwindle down, but I know my car. I know I'm not going to run out. I only ran out of gas one time. <laughs> Thought I knew my car. I was just trying to get to Costco's to get gas, but mm, didn't happen that way. Probably like mm, a little over half. I ran out, yeah. So I had to call AAA. AAA came to my rescue, of course. But yeah, that was a little embarrassing. I won't do that again. Because Costco's is a little far away from me. But I love their gas. 
anyways this is not about costco's gas and me pumping gas because y'all just know i don't like pumping gas well if y'all didn't know now y'all know you know what i have new followers so hello everyone how are you doing thanks for subscribing welcome to my channel i'm so glad to see you all i have hit like 250 subscribers i'm so happy and i'm so thankful for you all for just tuning in to hear me ramble <laughs> about weight watchers and exercising but hopefully i'm motivation to you and everyone else around because that will be perfect um we hold each other accountable this is all positive vibes no negativity let's just get it together we all gonna have our ups we're all gonna have our downs so i'm here to share that with you all with my journey because lord knows i have ups and downs i've been on this weight watcher kicks and i've been on it this time around three four months and then i've been a lifetime member back in 2000 i always get this wrong 2009 i believe is when i became a, a lifetime member after losing 80 pounds so that was my first round now this is all about getting that baby weight off so i'm trying to lose 60 pounds for all my new people out there but if you want to go see my other vlogs and just kind of catch up uh just go to my channel you'll have a good time hopefully i get better and better at this vlogging thing because i mean it's a little weird talking to a camera but no one sees me i'll make sure i look around before i start talking because i don't want to look weird <laughs> anyways let me get in here get my workout in for the day i will talk to you guys all right toodles this is so cold i just left the gym did 30 minutes of cardio kind of to end the week because it's been a long week exhausting week so i just did cardio to end it kind of relax a little bit my hair is a whole mess but it is what it is it was just yesterday was so intense with darren's workout i'm sore everywhere like all of them shoulders everywhere so today i was just like let me do some light cardio to kind of eat in my week not just doing nothing's not going to be the answer so i like to do something when i'm super super sore today with my points i am doing awesome as usual but water not so much oh why gotta do better let me take a sip okay i'm doing better not really but anyways uh yeah water sucks one of these days I'm going to get on the vlog and I'm going to be like, water was awesome today, guys. I went a whole week with over 72 ounces of water. Never happens for me. It's always, I get busy. You know what? I'm not even going to blame being busy. I'm just lazy. Like, when it comes to drinking water, I'll look at the water bottle all day long and be like, I got to drink. I got to drink. And the time just passes me by. And I never pick it up. But <laughs> I know there's others that struggle with El Agua, too. But... It's so hard for me, but I'm not gonna vent anymore. I just wanted to come in just to say, hello everybody. How are you doing on this lovely Friday? So I'm gonna get off here because all I'm doing is rambling. And I'll talk to you guys probably tomorrow when I do a Peloton workout because it will be Saturday. I stay at home on Saturdays. I don't come to the gym on Saturdays. So I do Peloton on Saturdays. I'll probably do weightlifting and, of course, either cycling or I might jog on the treadmill. I don't know yet. So I'll get back to you tomorrow and let you know what I choose to do in regards to workouts. And I might even vlog my day of eating. Why not? Just because it's a new plan, I need to show y'all what I'm eating, you know? That would be great. So I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye bye. Say happy Saturday. Me? Yeah. Happy Saturday today. Happy Saturday, Lord Jesus. She's the only one that's presentable this morning. It is Saturday. We are going to eat breakfast. I like to go on Saturday mornings. Breakfast is already, is usually Saturdays and Sundays. I'll eat breakfast. Other than that, I don't eat breakfast Monday through Friday. So today, of course, I got eggs, which are zero points for me. Three slices of turkey bacon, that's three points each two slices of toast which is healthy life toast or bread and i toasted it up and that's two points so that's three plus two is five 
And then one tablespoon of jelly is one point. That's one point with that. So that's six points total for this. I'm gonna drink some Sprite Zero, which is zero points. And then I got some El Agua. Yes, yes. Get out of there. And this is gonna be Cadence's. Of course, she eats her, she loves meat. And then a little bit of bacon that she's, or uh, eggs that she's probably not gonna eat. Some toast and yogurt. You ready to eat, Squirrely? Yeah. All right, let's go. Done with my workout. <clears throat> and look, she let me do it. <laughs> She's still asleep. It's always a plus because it's hit and miss with her in regards to taking a nap or not taking a nap. Struggles real with me in Saturdays and Sunday workout when she's here. So today I got my workout in. I did 60 minutes of boot camp with Tunde. Y'all did see that. And I burned 400. I believe it was roughly almost, let me see. 428 calories total 
that was pretty good workout because I'm kind of used to that now that I go to um, edge and do it on Tuesdays and Thursdays so the boot camp isn't it's kind of equivalent to that minus the cardio the bike or the tread so it's more focused on uh, calisthenics when it comes to um, jumping squats stuff like that so her workout wasn't that bad it was a plus I usually shy away from the cycle boot camps or the tread boot camps on Peloton but with me going to these classes I have a little more confidence in regards to actually completing it because at one point in time when I was doing it, especially like jump squats and push up, I would just like give up to the point where I wasn't getting a good workout. Now I know, keep pushing myself through it, eventually I'll get better and better and better. So my confidence level have risen a little bit when it comes to like push ups, planks, jumping, whatever you wanna call them. Anything jumping or from a plank to a jump type situation. So I feel a little better in regards to that now that I'm doing the boot camp or the classes at the Edge Fitness Club. But anyways, having lunch. I did one cup of my soup as usual because we're going to go shopping. We got to go to Costco's, Menards, Target, and I don't know where else. So she's getting a good nap, which is good. I think she's almost going on two hours. Praise God. But anyways, let me get my lunch. Oh, and water. So technically, I'm almost done with 36 ounces. Please disregard this because I filled it up halfway. So I've almost completed 36 ounces on a Saturday. Saturdays and Sundays, I really don't get no water. If I struggle on the weekdays, weekends are even worse. Sometimes I don't even get a sip in. So anyways, this is two points. And then I'll have two tablespoons of this, which is only one point. And they are tortilla strips. I like to have something a little crunchy on top of this because it just makes it I don't know, it tastes a little better. So one extra point's not gonna hurt me. So I haven't had anything else other than my breakfast that I showed y'all and now it's lunch. And then I'll probably have a little snack. I'll show you all that. And that's pretty much it. So let me go ahead and get my lunch done before she wakes up, get my shower done before she wakes up and we can get to these stores before they close because they're probably already wild I'm sure it's probably gonna be so crowded but if I can get some footage while I'm there I'll do that for you all because I just need to get a couple of items not too much it's not really gonna be in regards to Weight Watchers but I am preparing for Thanksgiving Day we're not doing anything big it's probably gonna be like four or five of us because we do a big dinner um, with the big with the families that are coming down from Oklahoma and Arkansas they meet here in Missouri and we'll do a big one uh, I think we're doing it the first of January. So it'll be like a collab of all three holidays, New Year's, Christmas, and Thanksgiving, just because uh, it's hard for us to get together for Thanksgiving. It's hard for us to get together for Christmas. So we just do it like January, and I usually do it here at the house. And we just have a big family thing. It's gonna be all family this year. Probably not so many friends just because of the Corona. I'm respecting our elders that we still have here with us and I'm rambling. Let me get off here, eat my lunch. It's cooled off now, so I'm ready to grow. Talk to you later. Bye.